Hello dear children and welcome to the series of Learn From Home, an initiative of DPS Ruby Park. And I'm your Dania ma'am and today we are going to learn number 5. What can you see here? I can see some smileys. Yes, let's count the smileys. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 smileys. Let's see another picture. What is this? I, I think these are leaves. Yes. Let's count the leaves. One, two, three, four, five. There are five leaves. Let's trace the number five. Sleeping line, standing line and one curve. One more time. Sleeping line, standing line and one curve. Very good. Let's see what is this. These are blocks. Let's count and stack the blocks together. And you will count with me. One, two, three. Four, five. Very good. Repeat with me. One, two, three, four, five. Excellent. Now let's see what do we have here. This is number five. Yes, very good. This is the number we are learning today. Now, is this number 5? No. Is this 5? No. Is this 5? No. Is this 5? Yes. So, we will put it here. And you will count with me 5 sticks. Let's begin. 1, 2, 3, Four, five. Very good. Let's do some more activity. All of you take out your right hand and count the number of fingers you have in your hand. Let's do it. One, two, three, four, five. Very good. You have five fingers in each hand. Five finger in the right hand and five fingers in the left hand. Similarly, you have five toes in your right leg and five toes in your left leg. Now let's do some more activity. See, these are some puzzles. Yes, we are going to solve some puzzles. This is the picture. Let's count the kites in the picture. One, two, three, four, five. Yes. Now, is this number five, children? No, this is number four. Will it fit here? No, it's not fitting. Is this number five, children? No, this is number 3. This is also not fitting. Is this number 5? Yes, this is number 5. Let's see if this matches. Yes, yeah, see how nicely it is matched with 5 kites. Very good. Now let's do some other activity. These are some shapes I've got. We are going to make number 5 with this. I've taken a sleeping line and one small standing line. Let's join it and a curve. So we are going to make number 5. Take a sleeping line. 
join a standing line here and what will come here a curve I've taken a curve and I will join it from the end of the standing line like this what did you make a number five yes very nice now trace it a sleeping line a standing line and a curve one more time a sleeping line a standing line and a curve this is number five now let's see how we are going to write number five a sleeping line a standing line a small one and a curve very good this is number five one more time a sleeping line a standing line small one and a curve very good this is number five now in the last video I told you you should help your mama and papa now let's see how today I'm going to help my mama my mama has washed some clothes and it needs to be dried up in the sun your mama and papa also washes their clothes and your clothes right so today we are going to put the clothes in the sun to dry off okay so I'll take some clips and take the clothes and put them in the sun for drying let's do it one short one shirt one vest one frock and one pant very good now let's count how many clothes you have hang out in the sun to dry let's count one two three four five very good let's count it one more time one two three four five very good now be good child and help your mama and papa in the work hope you enjoyed and learned number five give me high five thank you